basically I'll highlight this section because that's the section that we want to work in. Um, let's play back. So I think the main thing that we got to do here is um, EQ for sure. Um, want to do some just general EQ moves. Um, what EQ should I use? I'm gonna try and just use API EQ um, just because I like that I can just kind of do general moves. It's not nitpicky with frequencies or anything like that. So um, basically, I just want to EQ these background vocals so that they're clear because um, they they do hold a, an important part in this section of the song. So let's try. Describe how good I feel when you're right. So that EQ helped a bit. Um, we're definitely gonna need another reverb. Um, let's see if we can use like a Valhalla. Um, uh, you know what, actually I really like the, let's see if we can find a hall, a lexicon hall. And I wanna send Output of this group to the verb two, and um, yeah, see what. The Can't describe how good I feel when you're right. Wish on a star, you be my. Can't describe how good I feel when you're right a big plate um or a hall let's do something smaller can't describe how good i feel when you're right wish on a star you be my sweet valentine can't describe how good i feel when you're right So I'm just going to leave that for now. Um, I just wanted a little bit of ambiance to those background vocals. Um, let's hear it with the lead vocal one time. Next to me. So it doesn't sound too bad. So the group three is very similar to group two. So I'm just going to copy this plugin. Um, sounds like all of these vocals were pretty much recorded on the same mic for this singer. So a lot of the plugins we can just copy over and have similar settings. I think um, this part, you know, seems very important to the song and I want it to be accentuated and be more exciting. So I'm going to compress it so it's more lively and like in front of the mix. Um, and to do that, let's try using, what compressor do I want to use? So many. We got so many compressors. Let's try using actually a 76. 
And uh, we want to compress this section, these vocals here, and just make them more exciting. So let's try this. Describe how good I yeah. feel when you're right next to me. So let's solo um, these vocals one time. Describe how good I. So we usually want a faster attack, not too fast, but faster attack and slower release to get that excitement. Describe how good I feel when you're right. Describe how good I feel when you're right. Describe how good I. Feel when you're right. We sure to start you be my sweet Valentine. Would you please describe how good I feel when you're right next to me? We sure to start you be my sweet Valentine. Would you please? So those vocals are definitely a lot more forward, um, which is good. Hey, what's going on guys? If you're someone who struggles with mixing, I have a free resource that I would love to share with you and that I think that could really help you. It's a new, brand new mini course that I've uploaded to my website called Six Mix Finalizers. In this course, it's going to teach you six different ways that you can finalize your mix. I know a lot of the times we get to the ending of our mix stage and we're just unsure if our mix is completely finished. By taking this mini course, you're gonna have complete confidence and satisfaction in that final mix that you do put so much time and energy into and you're gonna be so confident in finishing it and finalizing that mix. This course is also gonna teach you six different ways to enhance your mix at the end of the mixing stage. So it's gonna give you some tips and tricks for things to look out for that a lot of people miss and a lot of people don't look out for when they're finalizing their mix. It's gonna show you how to get the perfect vocal volume in your mix. It's gonna show you how to tighten up your bass, get more punch, a lot of great things to enhance your mix right at the end as you're about to finalize it. So if you want complete confidence and satisfaction with your mixes and just knowing that, yo, I've done everything that I possibly could and I know that this mix is done now that I've taken this course and I learned a few things, you can totally take that course completely for free. Link is in the description below to take that course on my website. So I hope I can show you guys a few things and become your teacher. Peace.